The most awaited festival of light, Diwali, is just around the corner and as Diwali approaches, people are getting busy with shopping, house cleaning and making more fortering dishes. So to replace your long time preparation into a short and easy option, today I am going to share with you a quick recipe of karanji or gujia. So let's begin. First I am going to preheat our oven at 200 degrees Celsius. Then let's start to make our karanji stuffing. Now pan is nice and hot. Let's add the condensed milk. Then add milk powder. Let's cook on a medium flame. Till all the mixture gets thicker and fluffy. Here you can see all the moisture has evaporated and it's almost done. And let this cool down for 5 minutes. Now our mixture has cooled down properly. In this mixture I am going to add freshly grated coconut, some almond flakes and mix it together. In this mixture, we are using freshly grated coconut. That's why I don't think it can be preserved for more than a week. Now it's done. Instead of making a dough here, I'm going to use puff pastry sheet. Now I'm going to cut this pastry sheet in a circle with the help of glass. So I will get equal size of karanji. Now I am going to place 1 tablespoon of coconut mixture in the center, keep the edges empty, bring the both edges together and press it gently. Don't add too much mixture otherwise it is difficult to shape them. Now with the help of fork I am going to Press the edges gently so we will get the nice design on the edge. And our karanji is ready to go in the oven. Now place them on the baking tray, leaving some space between two pieces. ready to go in the oven for 30 minutes and it's done. Now our karanjis are out of the oven. Transfer them into a cooling rack. Enjoy this Diwali with this quick and easy sweet. Happy Diwali!